It's time for our daily devotion, daily daily of abiding in Jesus Christ. In the book of John chapter 15 verse 7. If ye abide in me, and my words abide in you, ye shall ask what ye will, and it shall be done unto you. A daily devotional ministry project of Christo Dojino Gaga from passages taken from the Holy Scriptures with quotations from the Spirit of Prophecy by Ellen G. White. Daily, daily, daily abiding in Jesus Christ. July 7, 2020 Ephesians 4 verses 11 to 13 And he gave some, apostles, and some, prophets, and some, evangelists, and some, pastors and teachers, for the perfecting of the saints, for the work of the ministry, for the edifying of the body of Christ d till we all come in the unity of the faith, and of the knowledge of the Son of God, unto a perfect man, unto the measure of the stature of the fullness of Christ. Quotation from the Spirit of Prophecy Learning, talents, eloquence, every natural or acquired endowment, may be possessed, but without the presence of the Spirit of God, no heart will be touched no sinner be one to Christ. On the other hand, if they are connected with Christ, if the gifts of the Spirit are theirs, the poorest and most ignorant of his disciples will have a power that will tell upon hearts. God makes them the channel for the outworking of the highest influence in the universe. By Ellen White Christ Object Lessons, page 328 Our prayer for you today. Our Father in heaven, with utmost humility, we approach your presence with awe and reverence because you are holy, just, good and most lovingly, you are our loving Father. We thank you for you have called us as members of your spiritual body here on earth. Today, we pray for unity as members of the Seventh-day Adventist Church which you have called to carry out and preach the three angel angels message throughout the earth. Thank you for answering our prayer because we ask in the name of the Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen.